experience traveling the world, seeking out cutting edge energy efficiency policy has been really something. And it's an experience for which I'm profoundly grateful for. And it has really driven me to really hone in on the intersection of urban planning and energy policy. And that intersection is not something that I think many people are really considering because like, how do we power cities? I mean, there's just lights everywhere. You know, the city of Chicago went on a massive um, um, project to rewire all of its uh, street lights, for example. All of the street lights in the city of Chicago are now LEDs. They, in fact, mimic the orange kind of glow of methane lamps from decades past because people were so concerned about losing that trademark glow of the methane powered street lights that the city of Chicago has had for its entire history. And so, which is why they kind of mimic that look. But in fact, all of the street lights in Chicago are much, much more energy efficient now because this is a big, big deal and a big, big question because obviously it takes a lot of energy to power literally all the countless buildings worldwide 24 seven. And a lot more people are thinking about the grid and grid resilience and this concept called demand response and load flex and all these things. And it's mind blowing stuff, but I don't know. I think, I think more urbanists need to really start to talk about it.